Well, before we get to our uh, country's national anthem, uh, Sunday evening, uh, as many of you in the racing community know, we did lose a uh, driver, uh, Deer Creek's Gary Cook Jr. lost his battle with cancer on Sunday evening. And uh, some of the uh, statistics here, he was born March 18, 1976, in Peoria, surviving his fiance Shannon, two children, Dawson and Sophia Cook. Uh, Gary graduated from Washington Community High School in the class of 1994. He worked in the sign manufacturing industry for several years before starting his own company, Cook Fabrication Signs and Graphics. He was a member of the Elevate Church in Morton. His racing career started at the age of 14 with many successful seasons, including several track championships. He won the UMP Modified National Champion and Regional Championship in 2009 while battling cancer. The number 64 has became synonymous with one driver in the modified ranks, and that, of course, is Gary Cook, Jr. Uh, again, we celebrate his life here tonight at the Fairbury American Legion Speedway. Uh, he had one outstanding profile here at the Fairbury American Legion Speedway. Uh, his first race at the Fairbury American Legion Speedway was May 15th in 1999. He won an astounding four track championships in the modified ranks from 2000, 2002, 2003, and in 2005. He is the second all-time winningest modified driver with 22 victories. He is the fourth winningest driver in the 2000s for our UMP Open Wheel Modified. His last night competing at the Fairbury American Legion Speedway was the Prairie Dirt Shootout on August 3rd, 2012, in which he finished ninth. And Gary, a true hard charger, a sportsman on and off the track. So at this time, I'd ask you to please remember Gary. Think back of maybe the first time you uh, saw him, whether it be in Victor Lane, on or off the track, or just enjoyed watching him racing. Race fans here tonight at the Fairbury American Legion Speedway, in honor, I'd ask you please a moment of silence for Pappy and Bob Allen Memorial and our dear friend, number 64, Gary Cook Jr. Thank you very much. If you'd uh, please remain standing, our country's national anthem.
So again, also we need to thank each and every one of these USBO wheel modifying competitors. I'm sure they were proud to do it. We'll get each one of them coming out here and taking part in the paid tribute to uh, not only 64 Gary Cook Jr., but uh, 